Queen City News has you covered this primary election night from both sides of the aisle. On the Democratic side, it's believed that Sherry Beasley will win when the polls close at 7.30 tonight. And she's joining the North Carolina Democratic Party for her election night watch party. Queen City News reporter Will Lewis is live there tonight for us. And Will, they just finished setting up for a big event in Raleigh. Tell us about it. Yeah, they sure have, Brian. You know, the tables are all set. There's music playing. They're just waiting for the people to show up. Like you said, this event is being hosted by the North Carolina Democratic Party, and they expect some big people from the party to be here tonight, including Governor Roy Cooper. Now, organizers also say they will hear from the Democratic nominee for the U.S. Senate race, and like we said, that is expected to be Sherry Beasley. So far, Beasley has been the front runner in the 11-person primary. She's a former North Carolina Carolina Supreme Court Chief Justice and people with the party say if she wins the primary, she has the name recognition across the state to face the Republican nominee. Now, Beasley says if she does win in November, she will go to Washington and focus on issues like food insecurity, broadband access, and passing the voters' Bill of Rights. So, like we said, we're just, everybody's here. We're just waiting for those polls to close and those results to come in. Right now, reporting live in Raleigh, Will Lewis. Yeah, City News. A lot of participation up in Raleigh tonight for the Beasley campaign. All right, well, thank you.